feel like a big explosion is coming. Kind of. Considering music that I heard from this band, this is very different. So I remember with the first album of this band, a lot of people accused them of copying um, Bring Me The Horizon of that era, which was Sam Paternal. I guess I don't see anything bad with it. Ooh. Open in that uh, chugginess. That's pretty cool. This is superb vocals. I've actually watched an acapella video on YouTube of this song. The production on the vocals are insane. The top tier vocal production, this is. This song in general is one of the best songs I've heard in 2019. It's really good. Super mosh pit friendly. What a fucking rhythm change that is. Another catchy chorus. Beautiful chorus. This is a great part. Awesome harmonies everywhere. This breakdown is also really, really good. Especially the second part. Whatever they're saying there. Nice bells. This. Ooh. Fucking beautiful. Mm. The band is showing off basically their versatility. We've heard, what, five songs so far? None of them really sounded the same. Ooh. Oh, that's disgusting. This is very Sam Paternal, I agree. <laughs> It's like I'm sleepwalking. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> they seriously just pulled a woof on me. Bamboozled. This is especially imminence with the violin and everything. Got a serious set of chills right here. Jesus. Ooh. That is such a great riff. With the lead in the background, like... This is amazing. I love long choruses, by the way. It's my weakness. Okay. So it's like a... Similar to the main riff, but a bit different. I respect that. I love the theme. The topic. The lyricism. This reminds me of... Uh, <laughs> A weird comparison, but Ask Alexandria's recent album. Ooh. Nice, big chorus. Empowerment. Let's go. As much as this is like something you would call very basic rock music, there's something about it that's so attractive and like fun to listen to. 